Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I'll be reviewing the Ubuntu 22.04 LTS beta version. I'm just trying out this version to see what's new in this version. So without further ado, let's get started. The first thing you will notice after installing this version that the desktop icons are on bottom right. So I can simply click on home and open this window. As you can see, the file explorer window is also redesigned. Now we have rounded corners on all four sides. Let me close this. Now if you go on top, you can see on the top left the activities window. If you click on the calendar, you will see the calendar. And all other tweaks are on the top right as usual. The next thing you will notice is that the redesigned show application. Once you click it, it will show all your applications. Another thing is that this Ubuntu version comes with horizontal scrolling. As you can see, you can scroll from right to left and left to right. So there are also some utilities folder. You can access your utilities by clicking on this folder. And also you can see your recent desktops on top. You can select any of the desktop environments just by simply clicking on it. You can also add one. So let's check out the desktop environments. Let me open file explorer in this environment. And then I'll open another desktop environment. Let me open Ubuntu software here. As you can see these two environments are different. You can also launch another environment from here. Another thing you can do is that you can simply drag one of the applications from one environment to another environment and simply click on it and you can get both of the applications in a single desktop so let me close this window now we'll have a look at some of the settings of this version so let's go to settings as you can see this version of ubuntu comes with different wallpapers here are some of the nice wallpapers you can explore so let me select this one or this one I think this one looks nice then I will go to the appearance section as you can see you can change the color tone so let me open file explorer and now I will change some of the settings so I can choose another color you can see all the folders are being changed to this color I can also select another color I can also go into dark mode just by clicking on dark and the dark theme will get activated. So let me click on light again. You can also change the size of the desktop icons. I can click on large and these icons will get larger. I can also change the position of new icons. You can also toggle on personal folders. Now regarding the dock, you can also click on auto hide dock, so it will get auto hidden. Let me close this file explorer. You can also change the icon size. Let's make it bigger. Right now the dock is on the left position. We can select it to be right or bottom. So the dock will be placed on the bottom. Now there are some other dock behaviors as well. For example, you can choose to show all your volumes. You can toggle between them. You can also choose to show the trash. You can also toggle the panel mode simply by clicking on it. As you can see, the dog is getting larger and smaller. I think this one looks nice. So these are all the appearance settings you can get with this version. So let me have a look at some of the other settings. For example, notification, search, and also multitasking. I think multitasking is added in this version. So we can actually enable hot corner. As you can see, it's getting activated. You can also activate the screen edge. So once we place some of the application, and drag it to the right or left, you will get the option to resize it. So if I place it, it will get resized. Let me close it. You can also select dynamic workspaces. 
you can also choose workspaces on all displays so it will show up on all the displays and there are some other settings as well and there is the about section as you can see this Ubuntu Jammy Jellyfish is using the GNOME 42 version so the Ubuntu 22.04 LTS version will be released very soon I think within 10 to 15 days from today I think this version of Ubuntu looks quite nice what do you think comment below and as always thanks for watching see you in the next video bye